They're after me now, aren't they? Go! I have orders to protect you with my life. My name is Luciani Buchanan, and I play Rose Larkin on The Night Agent. Look, I need to keep this line open, all right? You've reached the wrong number. No, 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 please, please, please. My Aunt Emma, Emma Campbell, her and my Uncle Henry are in danger. They told me to call you. Hello? Yeah, I'm listening. Um, the thing I love about Rose is actually her hacking skills. I don't know a damn thing about hacking. <laughs> <laughs> You found something. This isn't a terrorist attack. This is an assassination attempt. But I mean, I'm sure that's, you know, finding out, you know, some tea on some people, that would be interesting. Um, and one thing she could work on is probably, um, I don't know, she's pretty perfect. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow, really? <laughs> uh, nothing. <laughs> so. Well, uh, my next question is now, you're filming Chief War where mm -hmm. the majority of the cast is plus speaker people. Mm -hmm. And we're, as specific honest, we, we don't really get shows with this big, with this ever. kind of, yeah. ever. So what, what's it With like? that budget and yeah. that scale, yeah. Um, I think it's beautiful. I've always had an interest in Polynesian history, so getting paid to learn about it and learn the language and be fully immersed um, is, absolutely a dream come true and the character I'm playing is pretty awesome so can't say too much but it's yeah it's pretty awesome Yo, sweet um okay for this one if you can say something just a shout out to your family if you okay yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so proud I love of you. them I love them yeah <laughs> so everybody's so proud of you and I know your family are making announcements in the in the group the Facebook group oh yeah chats and stuff well, what do you want to say to them? Um, do I say it to camera? Yeah. Yeah. Um, hi, family. I love you all so much. And uh, thanks for all the posts and all the roasting. They're already roasting me. Um, <laughs> what are they roasting you on? Everything. <laughs> like the accent. Someone killed my aunt and uncle, and now they're trying to kill me. They're like, oh my god, you're here. <laughs> Look at how straight your hair is. I'm like, <sighs> but yeah, no, I love you guys for real. And um, yeah. Can't wait to come home and hug you all. Yeah. What inspired you to get more behind the camera and, and how's that going? Um, there's just like nothing that I guess our people can relate to out there. And um, we've always looked to, you know, other outlets and even black media and black music and, and I guess, and Māori um, films, are, you know, paving the way for indigenous filmmaking and I don't know, I'm just so interested in what we have to share because we are natural born storytellers. And I mean, if if I can help in any way or like open the door, hold the door open for the next generation, that would be amazing. Yeah. Okay, and then one last question. Mm -hmm. and, and this is inspired by the conversation we had last night. Um, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're friends, we go way back. <laughs> no, as a, as a, well, you know, um, and I'll let you answer it, but mm. as, as a Tongan mm -hmm. storyteller, mm -hmm. what's what's a film that's really um, inspired you to, you know, to get your to get your own kind of storytelling going? Oh my gosh, so many! But um, we were talking about this. Um, I feel like in like Pacific stories, we have um, the tendency to do a lot of comedy and lighthearted stories. But um, one film that always stands out to me is The Orator by Tusi Tomasese. Like, it's still just the best film and it's just full of so much heart and it really encompasses what it is to be someone and it, it's just so beautiful I can't I can't describe it but yeah wait how do you say it in some Ole Tula Fale Ole Tula Fale yep okay. oh here comes the, oh, oh. the orator in her popping out <laughs> all right also can I just say I'm so happy to be doing this with you <laughs> I lived on um Crit's couch for two two weeks when I, like yeah, yeah, when I first moved to LA <laughs> and it's so surreal doing this with you.